Sickle cell anemia is a very, very difficult disease. It's extremely common, especially in the African American population. About 8% are carriers, and uh, about half a percent are actual sufferers of the disease. It's a disease where the red blood cells become misshapen and clog in the small blood vessels and, 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 and starve the, the tissues of oxygen. And so it makes for a very, very painful and ultimately destructive and inexorable decline of uh, tissue and organ function. We can treat this and potentially cure it with bone marrow transplantation. But we need to make bone marrow transplant even that much safer. Right now, we're offering transplant to only the sickest patients with sickle cell anemia, where we think the, the toxicity and risk of the transplant is warranted. In the future, based on work that we're doing today in the laboratory in mice, we're hoping to improve the safety and effectiveness of bone marrow transplant. And the main strategy is to use a patient's own cells to make stem cells from the sickle cell anemia patient repair the sickle gene defect right in those cells, and then make healthy bone marrow cells to transplant back into the patient. This would affect a much more safe procedure, and ultimately, we hope, one that would cure large numbers of patients.